स्पीक हरी कर Respectful obeisances to uh, all of our Vaishnavas present, particularly Shri Bhagwan Raj. But you love this one, Raj, my beloved gurus. Um, just one thought that was coming to my mind when Raj was speaking yesterday. Um, yesterday when Maharaj was speaking was he was saying that we're not disregarding lower platforms of activity in devotional service and I was remembering one uh, Qatar of Srila Bhakti Vikandharati Maharaj where he's explaining that his when they were building the Pushpa Samadhi in Vrindavan for Bhakti Daita Madam Raj. So in India, um, you usually have a bamboo construction. So they put a bamboo construction like scaffolding, it's called in, in the West. So then on, the, on the evening before um, Disappearance Day, um, all of the God Brothers are saying, please take the scaffolding off so Samadhi will be there. And uh, Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj said, no, no, I, I didn't dare do that. Mm. He said, because the cement had not actually dried for the samadhi. So he said, if I took the scaffolding off, then in time, the building would slowly collapse. Um, and then the purport of what he was trying to explain was that our bhakti as a secondary platform, Daivi Vana Ashram has to be practiced. If we let go of Daivi Vana Ashram prematurely, then our bhakti may collapse very quickly and prematurely. So there's a balance between letting go of something that appears external, which is supporting our bhakti too early um, in the name of trying to practice something internal too quickly. So I just was considering that point when you're saying, go further, go further. So just this point I wanted to share today. Hare Krishna. Okay. So first of all, I'd like to pay my humble obeisances to the Lotus Feet of my spiritual master. Namo Vishnu Paramahansa Parajakacharya Shtotra Shashishima Bhakti Nanda Vanko Swami Maharaj. Thereafter, I pay my obeisances to the Lotus Feet of the Gaudiya Guru Parampara. And <coughs> finally, I pay my humble obeisances to all senior Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis and all respected guests. Um, so I've been caught a little bit off guard. I didn't I wasn't expecting to speak. But um, yeah, so yesterday um, was the uh, disappearance day of uh, Rai Ramanda. <coughs> and um, 
by many of the speakers. Uh, it was told, uh, well, it, was, it was described, the beautiful dialogue that took place between Sri Jaitanya Mahaprabhu and uh, Rai Ramananda. Um, and actually, this, is, this dialogue that took place is perfect satsang. Um, the perfect questions were asked um, and the perfect answers were given. And um, there's a shloka, I, I, I forgot, but uh, there's, uh, there's many people, but they never have the opportunity to listen to Harikatha. And even out of the few who have an opportunity to listen to Harikatha, there's very few who actually deeply understand it. And to find a very... Um, accomplished speaker is is very rare and even more rare than that is to find a a listener who is able to take them imports on board um, and in this way um, I'm speaking about myself sometimes we can be sitting in Harikatha but we we're not fully well, I'm not fully digesting, um, or I'm not fully reviewing um, what's being said um, and uh, meditating upon it. But the, uh, the fruit of Shravan only comes if we meditate upon what has been spoken in Harikatha. We chant and we remember. And this is, this is the perfect way um, to observe this limo of Bhakti called Shravan. Um, there's many types of um, narratives that are pushed out there and um, many kinds of um, uh, th things that people are told about and, and as Gurudev was saying that people are very um, uh, eagerly listen to um, like a material uh, um, uh, like to, to watch a, a movie or to um, uh, to listen to anything that is material, but when it comes to Harikatha, we um, we sometimes feel like uh, this is um, this is way over our head, or it's it's too much. However, the the best way to listen to Harikatha is to even if you don't understand it, um, then you should just sit yourself in front of the sadhu uh, with a inquisitive mood, uh, respectful mood, and without a, um, an, uh, um, without duplicity. And then, in that way, um, you will receive the benefit of um, listening to um, Harikatha from a, um, a pure version of. So, um, I think that's the point, that's the point I would just like to make about Shravan. And um, I, I pray to Gurudev and to all Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis that um, I will be able to take these, uh, these things that um, my Gurudev is giving uh, on board one day. Uh, O Magyana Timirandasya, Gyananjana Sharakaya, Kshakshu Militamina, Tasmai Shri Gurave Namaha, Bansha Kalpa Tarudyasha, Kripa Sindhu Bhyayevacha, Patitanam Pavane Pyo, Vaishnavi Pyo, Namo Namaha, Shri Krishna Chaitanya, Prabhu Nityananda, Shri Advaita Galadha, Shri Vasadi Sigura Bhakta Brinda, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ramo, Hare Ramo, Ramo Ramo, Hare Hare. 
First of all, I would like to offer my uh, most humble obeisances at the lotus feet of my Diksha Guru, Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj, as well as at the lotus feet of my Shiksha Guru, Srila Bhaktivedanta Vana Goswami Maharaj, to all of our Rupanuga Guru Parampara, to all of you, dear brothers and sisters, and all of our guests today, I would like to offer my most humble obeisances. So we feel so fortunate to be in your association and in the presence of Sheila Malan. She has very kindly taken us from Holland to Lithuania to Spain, back to Holland, to Italy, and now we are back in UK here with you. And it's so deeply humbling to see how much Maharaj is spreading this message of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, this pure love and affection tirelessly, with so much patience, and to see how much joy is awakened, how much connection to Bhakti is awakened in the heart of all those fortunate souls who come and receive this powerful injection of the Harikata of Srila Maharaj. And Srila Maharaj, as we know, has been traveling since more than 25 years all over the world, isn't it, Ramananda Prabhu? <laughs> and uh, it is really uh, such um, an extraordinary event in the, for the world and in our lives, how much it touches all individual hearts. And when we were in Italy, the disciple there of Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj had so many memories of Srila Gurudev, so much Udipan, and they were explaining also how every year they publish like uh, four books of Srila Gurudev in Italian. And as we know, they have been also organizing all this beautiful festival in Europe over the years. And so, so much Udipan was coming also in the heart of Srila Maharaj, remembering the glories of Srila Gurudev. And I remember that Srila Gurudev was, uh, when I first heard the Harikata of Srila Gurudev, he was explaining how uh, he was standing at the shore of the ocean of Prem. And Srila Maharaj had also explained that his uh, Prem Samudra is like the Rasa dance. And at that time, Srila Gurudev was saying, I want all of you to come with me at the shore of that ocean. Because from the, from the sky, there is a sweet breeze coming that is saturated with unlimited droplets of pure love. And I want all of you to come with me there, so you will receive this shower of Prem. And this was something so extraordinary that really touched my heart. And uh, I have really the feeling that Srila Maharaj is taking all of us again and again at the shore of this same ocean to deeply touch our heart and bless our lives. So in this way, we can all only uh, make our life successful if we really deeply imbibe this beautiful Harikata in our hearts and uh, take full advantage of like uh, listening carefully to this beautiful Harikata, letting it enter in our, through our ears, in our heart. And this is beautiful verse that has been uh, composed by Srimati Radhika. That says, Tavakatam ritam tapta jivanam kaviviriditam kalma sapaham shamana mangalam shri madatatam bhuvigriyantite buridhajana. So, in other words, he said, Who is the best donor in this world? Yes, that person who is giving Harikata this connection to the Supreme Law to awaken this uh, Bhakti Lata beach in our heart and nourish it with so much uh, transcendental instruction with the foundation of uh, Bhakti Tattva that is very essential to build upon the Bhakti Ras, to enter in those deep transcendental moods. So for all those in this world who are suffering from the separation of the Supreme Lord, by receiving the narration, the transcendental narration of those pastimes, their uh, feeling of separation can be relieved and they can uh, get full benefit. So in this way we can understand that you are so extremely fortunate to receive uh, this beautiful Harikata. And we were reflecting to the fact also that you are in Brighton here, by the sea. <laughs> we saw so many people out here and uh, thinking about the powerful uh, Harinam Sankirtan. And Srila Maharaj was saying, Harinam Sankirtan is very good, but there needs to be distributing flyers with an address, a preaching center where people can go. And in this way, we are so fortunate here to have Koruna Didi and Madame Gopal Prabhu, who have come here recently. <laughs> and we are receiving all of us today for the second day, and they have regular program here, and this is very, very favorable. And we would like to thank them for receiving us, yes? And uh, as well as Ramananda Prabhu, who have moved to Brighton as well, no? 
So we are, yes, best kirtan, yeah, and he gives beautiful presentation. <laughs> and we have Nali Didi coming regularly as well to Brighton to nourish this uh, Harinam Sankirtan and to uh, inspire people to come and to take full advantage of this uh, Sangha here that can grow and grow because it's a very favorable place and we have many beautiful elements here that can be serving very favorably. So and we would like to thank all of you and uh, hope to be back soon here with you and especially I would deeply thank to Sheila Maraj for uh, tirelessly coming year after year, time after time. He was even regretting to not go to London. He was saying, Oh, all those people in London, they would have been happy to have me there, yes, so he always uh, doesn't uh, think about his own, uh, how do you say, sorry, I'm a bit uh, lost now, he doesn't think about his own comfort, but he always thinks how he can nourish the bhakti in the heart of everybody, so this is quite very, very extraordinary, so we would like to thank Maraj for his tireless effort to connect us to <laughs> Agyanati Miranda Sigyana and Janashala Kaya Jack Shurin Militam Yen. That's my shame, good of you know. First of all, I offer my most humble Dhamma Pranam and to my Paramaradi Tamukurde Vishnu Bad, Paramahams Puribaj Bajaja. Ashwatra Shadashi Shimad Bhakti Vedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj, Nantu Om Vishnu Pad, Paramahansa Paribhaja Kacharja, Ashwatra Shadashi Shimad Bhakti Vedanta Par Maharaj, Intai Rupa Anuga Guru Gaudiya Guru Varga, all Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis here present, Mai Dandavat Pranam. So, you can't recognize a fool when they're silent. When they open their mouth, then it's exposed. So Maharaj has decided to expose me. And now you can all know how wonderful of a devotee I am. I was thinking on the first day already when Maharaj was speaking, um, and an example came to mind from something that I learned at work. See, I don't remember Harikatha, but I remember things from work. While in Harikatha, everybody's at work trying to think of Krishna, I'm doing the other way around. What happened is, I had a training. You know when you have a fire marshal training? They teach you. That when the building is on fire, as a fire marshal, you'll go inside and the people that are still there, you tell them one, two, maybe three times, there is a fire, leave the building. If they don't leave the building, you don't stay to try to convince them to leave, otherwise you also burn and both of you die. So you give a warning and then you leave. And when you leave, you go outside and tell the fire brigade, oh, on the second floor, um, in the kitchen, Vishnu Priya is still there, she didn't want to leave. And then they know. And then the fire brigade goes to save, but we cannot save. So in the same way, we come together, we have our weekly programs, um, we do different things together, but we are like those people in that office. Together, we are trying to fight the fire of this samsara dava, this material world. And we try to help each other, we warn each other, even though we're ourselves burning, and we tell once, twice, thrice, and we get into fights, trying to convince each other that we're doing it the right way. Come, come, you're burning. No, you're burning. But until the fire brigade in their special uniform, their saffron uniform, comes and saves us, it is not the same thing. So we're very fortunate that even though we come together by ourselves, it is not the same as when we're together with a special fire marshal that sends o that send over um, in a special uniform can fight the fire, can save us. And so we're very fortunate that we're here together in the association of such a personality as Sri Maharaji um, and that we should take full advantage because by ourselves, the entire year through, we try as much as we can. And of course, there is some benefit there, but it cannot compare to when the fire brigade comes and actually saves us. One check up through this. Yeah, he's in the car. He's sleeping. Okay, who is speaking here generally? You? Madam? Who is speaking? Who is speaking? Um, anyone else? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, he speaks on the programs. Oh, the program. Uh, Ramananda and uh, Anangamohan and Yamuna. Um, 
like like myself, continue doing everything else um, which actually doesn't give us real happiness or doesn't um, give us real benefit in, in life. Um, so I just want to say thank you to, to Maharaj um, and um, thank you so, so much um, that you're, you're always glorifying everybody but um, so today is my moment to, to say thank you to, to you. And um, <laughs> to say every, every day, Maharaj, but really I'm, I'm, I'm saying that on the, on, on the microphone. So, I, yeah, and and um, I just want to say for, forgive me as well <laughs> if any, any offense also. Um, thank you. Om Gyan Timirandasya Gyananjana Shalakaya Chakshur Militam Yena Tasmai Shri Guru Venamaha Panchakalpa Tribhyascha Kripa Sindhu Bevacha Patitanam Bhavani Bhyo Vaishnavi Bhyo Namo Namaha I'd like to offer my unlimited tenet pranams and to those who speak of my spiritual master, Nithi Lila Parishna Mishnapad, as the third Sri Srimad Bhakti Ranta Nangar Swami Maharaj, and to those who speak of Sri Bhad Bhakti Ranta Vamukha Swami Maharaj, who is present here with us today on this most auspicious day of being able to speak some Harikatha in the presence of all the Vaishnavas and Vaishnavas, my god brothers and god sisters. Um, Maharaj has asked me to speak a few words and to purify myself, really. And to try and remember what he has said and what our Guru Dev has said. And he has said many things. And yesterday was a very special day on the disappearance day of Rai Ramananda. And particularly, Srila Guru Dev was very particular on this uh, topic and the conversation that Rai Ramananda had with Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. A very important conversation. That Rai Ramananda, uh, through the questions and answers, he took us to a level of understanding of the highest uh, uh, aspirations, our highest goal. And Srila Maharaj started yesterday by identifying and speaking about what is our goal, establishing our goal. And without that, if we don't have a goal, then we don't have any practice, we don't have any sadhan, we don't know what to do to achieve our goal. Or we'd be doing things just for the sake of doing them. And this is the conversation between Raya Ramananda and Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. The a speciality of this is that Sri Rai Ramananda is Vishaka Devi in Krishna's pastimes. And uh, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is Radha and Krishna combined. So, uh, um, at why Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu appeared? And uh, Srila Maharaj and our Shastras also speak of this shloka Sri Radha Pranay Mai Makidrisho Veneva. Um, and in this shloka, the rest of it. <laughs> So, in the shlokas, the three main points are Mahima, Madhurima, and Sokhyam, mm -hmm. that uh, are very important. Mahima means the glories of Srimati Radhika's love for Krishna. Uh, Madhurima, the sweetness that uh, she experiences from her love to Krishna. And the happiness, uh, Sokhyam, that she gets from that experience. And Krishna didn't know this. He, didn't, he could not understand Srimati Radhika's love. So he had to come as Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And he took her mood and he took um, her complexion. Right? But he was Krishna himself. And so he, in this way, through the conversation between Rai Ramananda and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, uh, um, he was, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was able to understand, take uh, Rai Ramananda as his teacher. So Krishna Maharaj mentioned yesterday, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu needed a teacher, a, a guru. And in the spiritual world, in Golok Vrindavan, Vishaka uh, Devi is very close uh, to Srimati Radhika. And very close in date of appearance, in her mood as well. Very, she's very sober, she's very quiet and silent. And she has those qualities of Srimati Radhika that is closest to her. But not because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is Radha and Krishna, he needed Vishaka, Rai Ramanda, to understand uh, 
her moods. So I hope this is some kind of summary of yesterday's um, talk that Srila Maharaj gave, and he wanted to continue to speak about that. He mentioned many points as well. If I look at my notes, I would uh, be cheating, but uh, <laughs> I try and remember as much as I can from my heart, and I, I, I hope that Maharaj is pleased with these few words. Many other things he said um, that <laughs> this uh, uh, Jiva, uh, uh, Jiva Anu, Bandus, uh, Jiva Sambanda Anuvriti, uh, Jiva Swarup Anubandhi Vriti. This is a very important point that uh, uh, this conversation between Rai Ramananda and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to bring out. What is the nature of the soul? What is the innate, what is our nature? He's trying to teach us this in these conversations. Our nature is that we're eternal servants of Krishna. Jivera Swarupoi Krishna Nitya Das. This was the main point and purport of Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Prabhupada in his uh, commentaries of Sri Ch uh, uh, um, uh, Chaitanya Charitamrita. Um, so, um, yeah, it's like this. He's, he's teaching us. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu came as a teacher to teach the living entities through all of his uh, examples in his life. Like we know that he stayed on this planet for 48 years, and 24 of those years he spent in uh, Navadweep as childhood pastimes, and 24 years he spent uh, in Jagannath Puri, in this mood of separation uh, that he, he wanted to um, experience himself and to share with the living entities, this very high... Uh, thing that no other sampradaya, even the Vaishnava sampradayas, other Vaishnava sampradayas could not give. Yeah, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu came to give us this. So we are very fortunate, very very special position that we have. And we should always uh, understand this very fortunate position, very spe uh, fortunate and special position that we have come across. Acharyas and spiritual masters who are carrying this message of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu not very long ago, only 500 years ago. So we're very close to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and particularly through the sadhus who are taking this message to other living entities. They're carrying this message of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and therefore they are very important. They're very important for us to try and practice. So I won't speak much longer. I know we have an early flight tomorrow, and Maharaj will want to get back and pack and we also have some preparation to do but thank you very much for um, allowing me to speak and purify myself and trying to reflect on what he said yesterday and uh, yes First of all, you have to turn the mic on, I think, maybe I'll... Namagena Tmandasya Gnanjana Slakaya Chakshimalitam Yena Tasmai Shri Gurve Namaha Vanchakalpa Dvibhyascha Kripa Sinna Vevacha Patita Nampa Vinibhyo Vaishnavibhyo Namanamaha Gove Gojandraya Adikaya Tatalaya Krishnaya Krishna Bhaktaya Tat Bhaktaya Namanamaha So, before I begin, I'd like to offer my humble, most respectful obeisances time and time again, for my heart like flowers, at the dust of the lotus feet of my Gurudev, Nichile Vishal Vishampad, Asto Tassata Shishi Mad, Bhakti Vedanta Narayan Goswami Maj. And at the same time, of my Koti Koti Dandavat Pranams, at the dust of the lotus feet of my Pam Gurudev, Nichile Vishal Vishampad, Asto Tassata Shishi Mad, Bhakti Vedanta, Swami Maj Papa and Nichila Vishnu Shipad, Asta Tarasata Shishima, Bhaktu Pipyan, Keshu Goswami Maj, and unto all Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis, and especially I offer my humble 
Then the Vipanams of the Dust and Lotus Feet of Shipad um, Ban Maharaj and to all assembled devotees here. So, um, Maharaj has asked me to speak on the first sloke of uh, Shri Ramananda Roy Samba. Um, really prepared, but I'll try my best. Okay. Sanchara, I can't remember the Sanskrit. So, basically, um, this verse is a very important verse. And Gurudev said, it's, uh, it contains the whole Ramananda Roy Sambat in essence. So, um, here it's explaining that it's comparing Ramananda Roy to be like a cloud. And um, Chitatani Mahaprabhu is like the ocean. So, um, what happens, the <coughs> cloud, it draws ray, uh, water from the ocean. And it collects that water and then rains upon the ocean and other places. So, it seems that Shitatani Mahaprabhu is inquiring from Ramananda Roy, oh, what is the ultimate goal of life? But, actually, in the, it, does it mean that Mahaprabhu, he doesn't know anything? Um, he's He's making these inquiries, like I was mentioning yesterday that Sanatan Goswami Pad, he inquired from Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, who am I? Why am I suffering the threefold miseries? What is the goal of life? But does it mean he doesn't know? No, he knows. He knows everything. But um, one must inquire from a realized soul. And of course, she said, Tani Mahaprabhu, Krishna himself, he knows everything. So, why was he inquiring from Ramananda Roy? Actually, as we have heard, who is Ramananda Roy? He's the Shaka Devi, the Shaka Saki. So, um, and Maharaj was explaining yesterday, and um, Ananga Mohan Prabhu repeated that Vishaka Devi is very similar to Shimati Radhika and she's uh, very similar in nature, she's the same age, she was born on the same day, like, the, like this. So, why did Mahaprabhu come? Mahaprabhu came to taste this Shivadeya Pranaya Mahima Kidrasho Vanyeva Sadyo Yen Buddha Madhavima Kidrasho Vamadiya Sokyam Cheshimana Bhavata Kidrasho Vati Lobat Sakikama So um, he came to taste these three internal desires um, to understand the that um, Pranaya Mahima, the glories of the Pranay that is there in the heart of Shimati Radhika, that <coughs> seems like an unfathomable ocean to Krishna. Um, he, cannot, uh, uh, he cannot reach the depths of that ocean. He cannot reach the heights of her praying. So, um, how to do this. So he had to take the form of Shitatanya Mahaprabhu, uh, um, this coming from the position of Vishaya Tattva to Ashraya Tattva, otherwise not possible. So, but still, he's taken, uh, stolen, borrowed <laughs> the mood and complexion of Shimati Radhika. But how will he really deeply taste that, and especially this Madanakya Mahabhav that's in the heart of Shimati Radhika that isn't even in 
any of our other sakis. How is it possible? <coughs> so he has to approach Bisheka Saki like he needs, like Marge was explaining yesterday, a guru in order to explain these things. So he's inquiring from Vasheka Saki in the form of Ramananda Roy. And um, so it seems that the cloud is pouring rain on the ocean, but the cloud is taking water from the ocean. So that knowledge is there in the heart of Shitatani Mahaprabhu. Certainly, but it's not realized knowledge. Therefore, um, Mahaprabhu is inquiring from Ramananda Roy, and Ramananda Roy is explaining so many deep tattva siddhants, uh, step by step by step. And Mahaprabhu is relishing. So, What's happening in the heart of Mahaprabhu when he's relishing what Ramananda Roy is speaking? Um, the heart of Mahaprabhu is like an ocean. And just like it's described at the time of Sati Nakshatra, that um, when, it, um, when a certain constellation is there, and cloud forms and um, it rains and when it falls on um, the oyster then it produces a pearl and the cow's hoof it um, produces gorocham so like this produces something very precious so in the same way in the heart of Mahaprabhu when that rain coming from the cloud of Ramananda Roy is, is showering in his heart like ocean, then what is produced there? Some very, very precious jewels. And uh, these jewels Mahaprabhu is relishing and um, in this way, he's realizing what Ramananda Roy is speaking, and he's realizing gradually, gradually, when Ramananda Roy is explaining the different types of praying, and Mahaprabhu is saying, Yes, please tell more, tell more from uh, Dashiras, Sakiras, Vatsaliras, and Madhuryaras, and this Kanta praying. So Mahaprabhu is relishing so much this that um, Ramananda Roy, when he's speaking and he's telling very confidential topics, then um, Mahaprabhu has to say, oh, putting his hand over my, oh, please don't speak anymore because his ecstasy is... Uh, increasing more and more and becoming like out of control so so like this um, this topic is very deep and very relishable and there's so many um, deep tapas there it's rasa tapa is there and like Srila Bhaktivinoda you know, Thakur explains in Jai Vadama that he's telling so much tattva sidan, but in the last, you know, how many chapters, maybe 10 chapters or so, he's telling this rasa sidan. So this is um, so important. We have to have the foundation to enter the palace, but um, we must build upon that. And how we can... Uh, built upon that, or how our, you could say, building <laughs> will be constructed and completed, is by hearing from the lotus lips of those realized souls, those bhavak, rasic, vaishnavs, who are completely realized and can give you 
these jewels in your heart. So, um, there's so much more <laughs> to explain. And it would be very nice to hear from uh, Shilpaki Banda on large more on this topic there's so much more so um banche kalpa dubi sa kita samudhi ka kita samudhi ka kita samudhi ka kita samudhi ka हाँ यदि गौरांग नहीं तो तभी की हो तो क्यों नहीं काम
कृष्ण भक्ति प्रदे देवी सत्वत नमो नम भक्ता अपराध लक्ष्य श्रीता काम सुंदर मुखा और 
ಕಾಲಿಕಾಲಿಪತಿರೀತ ನಯನ ಪಥ ಜಗನ್ನಾಥ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ನಯನ ಪಥ ಹಾದೇವಿ ಕಾಕುಭರ ಗದ ಗದ ಅದ್ವಾಚ ಜಾಚಿ ಪತ್ತಿ ಭುವಿ ದಂಡ ಬದುರ್ಭುಟಾರ್ತಿ ಅಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಸಾದ ಮಂಗಲಶ್ಯ ಕೃತ್ವಾ ಗಂಧರ್ವಿ ಕೇಜಗಣೆ ಗಣನಾಧಿ ಪದಾಬ್ಜಸ್ತವ ವಿಘ್ನ ವರದಾಶ್ರಮೇವ ನನ್ನಾತ್ ಕದಾಪಿ ಸಮೇ ಕೀಲ ದೇವಿ ಜಾಚಿ ಸಖಾಯತ ಮಮೋ ನಮಸ್ತು ನಮಸ್ತು ನಿತ್ಯ ದಸ್ಸಾಯತಿ ಮಮೋ ರಸಸ್ತು ರಸಸ್ತು ಸತ್ತ ಸಿರೂಪಮಂಜರಿ ಕರಾರ್ಚಿತ ಪಾದ ಪದಮ ಗುಷ್ಣನ ಭುಜಾರ್ಪಿತ ಮಸ್ತಕಾಯ ಹಾ ಮದದ ಕನಕ ಗೌರೀ ಪದಾರ್ಭಿಂದ ಸನ್ವಯಾನಿ ಸನಕೈಸ್ತವ ಕೇಂ ಕರಿಷ್ಯೆ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ನ ಪ್ರಣಾಮ ಲೋಟಸ್ ಪೀಠ ನಿತ್ಯಲೀಲಾ ಪ್ರವಿಷ್ಟ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪಾದ ಅಷ್ಟೋತ್ತರ ಸತಸ್ಯ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ವಾಯಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಭಕ್ತಿ ರಕ್ಷ ಶ್ರೀಧರ್ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಯಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದ್ ಪ್ರೀ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಯಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವಿಜ್ಞಾನ ಭಾರತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಯಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಸೀನಿಯರ್ ಡಿವೋಟೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ವೈಷ್ಣ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೈ ರೆಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ಫುಲ್ ಗೆಸ್ಟ್ just i want to speak speak few words not too much time to eh yes study we also nicely celebrated the dis- disappearance day of rayaram kasan rayaram ananda who is very near and dear to lord chaitanya mahaprabhu and specially rayaram ananda he was in krishna lila that is called ವಿಶಾಖಾಶಕ್ಕೆ 
श्रीमती राधिका सी एक्सप्रेस्ड और ओपन हर हार्ट इन फ्रंट ऑफ विशाखा विशाखा रिस राधिका कहे उघाड़िया उघाड़िया से ओपन ही हार्ट स्पेशली हरि कृष्ण लेफ्ट वृंदावन टू मथुरा देन श्रीमती राधिका सी फेल्ट बैंक ऑफ सेपरेशन फ्रॉम कृष्ण जे एंड नाइक सी वाज क्राइम कहा और ए हायर आई विल गो मीट विथ माई बिलाविड कृष्ण दैट इज कॉल दिव्य उन्मादिनी राधा ट्रांसेंट्रल मेडनेस ऑफ श्रीमती राधिका दिव्य उन्मादिनी समटाइम्स श्रीमती राधिका से एम्ब्रेस्ट टू ललिता और समटाइम्स टू विशाखा एंड एक्सप्रेस इज हार्ट ओपन इज हार्ट एंड क्राई एंड क्राई एंड समटाइम्स श्रीमती राधिका सी कंप्लीटली हार्ट फेंटेड एंड सो मच विरोहताप विरोहताप मीन्स श्रीमती राधिका दे ऑल्सो मेड वेरी नाइस ब्यूटिफुल बेट विद ऑफ द फ्लावर्स But so much heat coming from the body of Sri Radhika, every second, every moment, mm-hmm. all the fetals completely dried, and again changing, again changing. Mm-hmm. And Sri Radhika, most of the time, she completely fainted, and or sometimes she completely let's call and unconscious. unconscious. And sometimes she opened her eyes. Or sometimes she closes her eyes. This is the situation. Crying this. Sometimes Sukhis of Simhati Radhika, they thinking Simhati Radhika, she left her body. body, and all they're crying and crying. Mm. Eh? This is. And, and sometimes Simhati Radhika she opened her eyes. In the meantime, she saw. One crow, crow, understand? Flying towards the mm-hmm. uh, direction of Mathura. Then Simhati Radhika, she is saying, "Hey crow, you are going to Mathura. Just give one message, message to Krishna. Now he is the king of Mathura. Uh, what the message? Hey." Uh, Simhati Radhika is saying these words. What the message? Mm-hmm. That if the fire caught in the cow cow shed, you know, mm-hmm. Bosala, mm-hmm. and all the cows mm-hmm. uh, around the surrounded by fire, surrounded with the fire. fire. What is the duties? Mm-hmm. The owner of the cow shed, and. Mm-hmm. Uh, What is the owner of the duties of the cow shed? You know, to free the cow. Yes. First, open the door. Mm-hmm. Eh? Understand? Because cow shed, sometimes they also close door. No. Mm-hmm. First need is what? Open the door. And second, those cows are tied with the rope. Eh? Have to. And tied the rope, mm-hmm. then cow they will go. The Simhati Radhika, she told this verse. Then, the crow, you are flying towards Mathura, so will give this message. Then, then Simhati Radhika again 
fainted in complete unconscious. Eh? What is the meaning eh? about the cow's cow shed? And eh? what is the meaning of fire eh? in Braj? That is called Krishna Viraha. Viraha means separation. This is like fire. All the Brijavasis, especially gopis, they have failed, they failed to think of separation from Krishna. 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 Eh? So all the gopis are thinking, now we are and here. Now everywhere, fire, fire of separation. Viraha means. Eh? And Krishna is the owner of the cow shed. Mm. So Krishna's duty is what? To open the door. Open the door. door. <coughs> and simultaneously untied the cows. A rope mm. with it. Eh? Mm -hmm. And cows. That means it. Simuti Radhika she is saying. And Hey Krishna, please come in Vrindavan and survive our life. Mm -hmm. eh? This is the thing. Only one thing this. Eh? We are crying, Simuti. Our Vrindu, we are crying this. So, <coughs> that means if Krishna will say, Hey, hey, Gopis, why you are crying for me? I will not return back in Vrindavan. Mm -hmm. Then we will give up our body. Eh? But Krishna will come. This is our mm -hmm. hope. This is called the mm -hmm. That the rope tied with our neck. neck. You understand? Mm -hmm. This is the thing. Why? Because when Krishna left to Vrindavan to Mathura, that time Krishna told one word. Gopi, they have faith with that word. What is that? Do you know? Parasu asime iti daitukam. That means Krishna told. Here Gopis, don't worry. Why you are feeling separation from me? Eh? Just eh? Today I am going to Mathura and tomorrow I will kill Kamsa and day after tomorrow I will eh? the thing. Just going and coming back. coming back. Not so long. How many days? Two days. Only one day. Actually. One day going and another later in the middle only one day. Eh? Today I am going mm. Mathura. Mm. At tomorrow I will kill Kamsha. And day after tomorrow I will return back. Parasu Asime Iti Dottakam. Krishna told you. But this, but many days, many months passed. Krishna did not return. Eh? This thing. Mm. What is God? He told Parsu, but Gaya, with Gaya, Parsu. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Understand? Mm. What do you say? He said that I will come back the day after tomorrow, but many years have passed by. Barsha. Yeah. Barsha means many years. Mm. Yeah. So the Hindi was a eh? yeah. कहते कहा बरसो ये परसो हाँ और बीत गए बरसो एंड देन ओनली ही टोल्ड आई विल रिटर्न बैक डे आफ्टर टुमारो बट मेनी इयर्स पास बाय डी नॉट कम है सो नाउ कमिंग इन दिस ओ हैम सेइंग इन दिस थिंग्स बिकॉज़ व्हेन सिमोदी राधिका सी फील फैंक ऑफ सेपरेशन of Krishna, Krishna Viraha. And sometimes she expressed open her heart with Vishakha. Sometimes 
told to Lalita Devi. Actually, this is the mood of Lord, same mood of Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. When Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was staying in Gambira and highest mood, separation mood coming. Birohir Kali Prabhu. Eh? At that time of separation, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, MDC Sarup Damodar and Raya Ramananda. Ugoriya Kaye Apana Hila. Then Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu opened his heart. Where will go? Eh? Where will I meet with my beloved Krishna? Called Sikhi Chandra Mauli Krishna. Where I go again meet with my beloved Krishna who holds the peacock feather on his tongue. Who always holds the flute in his hand. Who plays the flute? Eh? Now Vrindavan Brinda, completely empty. 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 As like mm -hmm. eh? what is called? Cemetery, no? Cemetery. 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 Mm -hmm. eh? Listen, this. This is Biraha. Eh? Now coming in this way, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he also asked Raidam the some questions. And right on the gave very nice, beautiful answer. This. Prabhu puche Ramananda kare uttar ei moto sei ratre katha paraspar. That night, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked some questions, and right on the gave some answer. Very nice, beautiful this katha. First Mahaprabhu asked, Prabhu ke vidya madde kon vidya sar? There are many kinds of knowledge in this material world. Eh? But what is the essence of knowledge? Again. Eh? Sa vidya tan matir jaya. Chaitanya eh? Mahaprabhu. Rairamanda told, Krishna bhakti vina vidya nahi aar. And in this material world, people, they are acquiring many kinds of knowledge. How many kinds of knowledge? Physics, chemistry, mathematics, <laughs> eh? science, arts, different, different knowledge. In this material world, different knowledge also. But what is the perfect knowledge? Sa vidya tan matir jaya. Sai se vidyar kal janiya nishchay krishna pad padme jadi Chitta vitti The essence of knowledge is if you have faith with Krishna Bhakti and you perform Suddha Bhakti. Other life is useless. Say say Vidyar Phal Janiyo Nishya Krishna Padvan Yudhi Chitta Vitti Rai. Vidya means that knowledge. Eh? In this material world, people, they also acquire different, different knowledge. In this way, they also call Mahagani. Mahagani, you understand? Great, Great scholar. scholar. Eh? Eh? That material knowledge is useless. And eh? when you live, when you give up this body, then knowledge is useless. Yeah. Next birth, again you practice knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. But if you acquire the Krishna Bhakti, that will be eternal and transcendent. Nehabi common asu was the Pratyavana Vidyate, Salpo Vyasa Dharma Satrayate, Motu Vayat. If you little bit practice Buddha Bhakti, that is called eternal and transcendental and free from all kinds of. And fear of death. Nihabi Kramana Asi Pratyavana Vidyate Sarva Vyasa Dharma Satrayate Mato Bhaya Shema Bhagavad Gita Very clearly explained. Bhakti. So, Raya Ramananda, he explained 
कृष्ण भक्ति विद्या बिना नहीं आ हर भक्ति कृष्ण भक्ति विद्या कृष्ण हाउ टू प्रैक्टिस डिवोशन सर्विस टू लॉर्ड विधातु टू नो द वर्बल रूट विधातु इज कॉल्ड टू नो मेनी काइंड्स ऑफ नॉलेज ग्लोबल एक्ट एंड बट ऑल दिस नॉलेज इज यूजलेस इन एंड वंस वन पंडित पंडित अंडरस्टैंड एंड कॉल्ड अ ग्रेट स्कॉलर एंड ही वाज स्टेइंग With his one disciple, and that disciple is very simple, very simple, simple, <coughs> simple, and simple. Very simple. And both are coming, going one place to another place. In the in the middle, one jungle forest. And and then Pandit Ji he asked his disciple, and. Now I am very thirsty. Okay. And could you search water here? But in, in the jungle, where will get the water? And dense forest, not going in water. Then, then disciple he finally he saw one oil. Well, I'm saying, but water is very deep down. And how to take out the water? And drink. You understand? Mm -hmm. How to? How will you take water? In the bucket. Huh? Bucket and the rope. Where do you get the jungle in the bucket? <laughs> 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 they are looking water. In the well, but there is very little bit far. Huh? Understand this? Then disciple asks his guru. Pandit ji, you know many vast, you have vast of knowledge. Only you are very proud of your knowledge. So you can uh, check your grantho and uh, books. <laughs> How to pick out the water from the? Then Pandit ji opened all his <laughs> books. Which slok is there? You understand? Which slok? And and tell me, and how to take out the water from the? Well, they know he's saying this. Many slokos you were watching, watching, eh? looking, but could not find out. Then Pandit Ji, they go. I'm very tired also. Now my throat completely dry, and without water, I cannot and survive my life. Okay. Then Pandit Ji said, "What will do? I have vast of knowledge, but I could not find out mm -hmm. eh, how to take out the water from the well." Wow. Eh. Then disciple saying very simply, "There is no Guru Dev, and you have long turban. Turban, <laughs> understand? You know Punjabi turban, understand? <laughs> Maybe ten meters." Long cloth. I Many is only little bit, no? Yes. <laughs> they, are, they, are, they are also, you know, Punjabi pagri. Have you seen? Turban? Yeah, big. Yeah, and doing big. Okay. First, you grow the hair. First, you survive your life. You give your turban. Well, am I turban? Well, yes. Everything knowledge in your turban. <laughs> so how do you know? Good day. I am associated with you many years. So I know. I I know. All your knowledge inside in your in time. How to take out the water from the? Well. Then Guru is saying, "Okay, take my time. First, need to also have water or not? Yes. Eh? Emergency. Emergency. Understand? <laughs> okay. So oh, he gave his time and his disciple. Eh? Then disciple because they that is long cloth, you know, maybe ten meters. Mm -hmm. And then he also then and put one stone mm -hmm. in the front mm -hmm. and down this way and going 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 going. Eh, understand? He hold the last yeah. part the end. end and that is going down. Mm -hmm. Then automatically water 
Sucking the cloth and coming and it will take down drink water. Yeah. 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 I am saying these types of knowledge not in the Shastra. <laughs> this is called the How to emergency period, what this is, and survive your life and drink your water. Mm. Yeah. This is common sense. Common sense. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Would you think this thing? No. <laughs> all you are thinking how to? That's <laughs> 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 a simple way, mm. eh? <laughs> And even if you know how to how to uh, what is called to protect your life, mm. that time you do everything. So, <laughs> eh? mm. Understand this? So that time, Pandit said, "Oh, oh. and." Uh, now you realize only nine atma pravachana labbha no medhaya no bahuna sute no jami visu brinte te no labbha te sesa atma vibrunte tanu sam. Because Bhagavat Tattva, transcendent things, just reading Shastra and or listen many times slokas and we cannot realize to Lord. How do you know? When Lord Himself manifests in your heart, then you realize this. I am saying even that this simple knowledge eh, coming from Lord. The disciple very simple way solve this problem or not? Mm-hmm. Eh? Yeah. And if you that what you do? You think how to take out the water? How, 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 how. <laughs> but that disciple very simple. Eh? Then okay. Then the guru and disciple then again walking in the forest. And in the meantime, when they enter in the deep forest, in the meantime, one tiger mm-hmm. and what is it called? Oh. Making the sound. Oh. Oh. That time disciple told Gurudev, now how to protect our life? Look, tiger is rolling, coming to us. Eh? Mm. Then Guru told Pandiji. Here Guru means Pandiji. Understand? Mm-hmm. Eh? And who has vast of mm-hmm. knowledge. So what this guy in India, eh? people are they saying those are vast of knowledge, also saying mm-hmm. Guruji Guru. Mm-hmm. Understand? Mm-hmm. And most of the people they are saying he is called Guruji. We have vast of knowledge, also called mm-hmm. Guruji. Guruji. Understand? Pandiji, Guruji, this word. Yeah. Even one rikshawala, rikshawala, no? mm-hmm. also tell me another rikshawala, what do you say? Guruji, Guruji. <laughs> and actually they don't know what is the perfect meaning of Guru. Just they using the last word. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So now coming in this way, Pandiji, then disciple told Gurudev, what will do now? Yeah. Then told, okay. Disciple told Gurudev, eh, we have to climb the top of the branch of the tree. Eh? Mm-hmm. Then you, in this way you can survive. Otherwise, how possible? Tiger will come and, and kill us. Eh? Then Guru told, hey! Mm-hmm. You are Bogas disciple. <laughs> <laughs> you do you know the meaning of Tiger. Tiger means Sanskrit word that is called Bagra. What did he say? Bagra. Sanskrit word Bagra. Or Sardul or Bagra. Eh? Sanskrit word. Bagra. And then Guru told his disciples, you don't know the meaning of Bagra. And I know everything. I know the back or on. Eh? Grammar. Sanskrit grammar. Eh? Bhagra means be vishes me granayati or what is called. That means sometimes you are taking the, the smell, you know. Mm-hmm. Gran means taking the smell. smell. <laughs> and granino or the bhojanam. Mm-hmm. And Sanskrit word saying if you take the smell, then automatically 50% you also have eaten. Have eaten. Understand? For this regard, 
And those who are Vaidhi Marga, um, uh, Seva, mm. they also put the cloth around their nose. nose. And mm. they don't want to take any smell, smell from the offering. offering. Uh-huh. And when they, mean they are cooking, mm. and mm. they also cover their, cover their nose with the cloth. Mm-hmm. And because Shastra is saying, mm. Granino or the Vajanam. Mm. If you take the smell of the food, <coughs> that means 50% also you are eaten. And you can see many also there. And especially Jagannath Puri and also other from there. When the cooking and offering Thakurji also cover their nose. No. No. So now he is saying the Panditji just he open his pages. And what is your grammar? Mm-hmm. And what pages? Grammar book. Grammar book. Mm-hmm. Background. Grayati. 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 He takes the smell. smell eh? This thing. And so that means tiger and oh, it, does not eat. it does not kill eat. or eat it anymore. Just it smell. smell eh? Because here this Shastra is saying in this way. <laughs> Background means this one. To take the smell. smell. <laughs> eh? So Sniffing. So it is better and eh? I lay down. And here, so and that the tiger just will come and disciple told Gurudev, your knowledge is not perfect knowledge. This knowledge is not perfect knowledge. The disciple or into disciple will take up first. I also save my life. And then the the, the the disciple, chala. He also climbed in the tree. 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 Our Pandit Ji, what will do now? Pandit still also laying down on the ground and open all his books. books. And, and what is the meaning of background? Understand? Background, background, background. What is the meaning of background? <laughs> in the meantime, that tiger came and he jumped up in him. Eh? And that time, he, that time he's saying, Oh, oh he had written. And, Kachit, Kachit, Khadanti. Sometimes, also. sometimes also. Eat. Eat. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? Eh? So, why I'm saying this? Only your knowledge you can understand this. Eh? This way. So for this regard saying, Sei se viddar phal janyo nishchay Krishna pad padme jodi chitta vritti rai. A Sanskrit word samad bhagwat or sugiti sa viddar tan matir jaya. What is the meaning of knowledge? Essence of knowledge again, that is called how our mind will concentrate with the Krishna, Krishna bhakti. If you not practice Krishna bhakti, and only collect or acquire the knowledge that they use this. Mm-hmm. Many people in this material world, they just they the collect the knowledge, reading, 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 but not they are Practice. practicing, not chanting holy names, not doing bhajan and sadhan, eh? just reading the book and, and speaking, commit on the memory and Vomiting the paper. paper. <laughs> <laughs> Understand? <laughs> so for this Zika, this slok also very clearly explained. Nayam atma pravachana labhu no medhaya no bahuna suteno jame vishay printo teno labhu tasis atma vibrunte tonusham bhagavat tatta prim tatta bhakti tatta raja tatta this is called transcendental. Eh? If you practice devotion service to Lord Suddha Bhakti, then socially everything is manifest in your heart. Eh? Your endeavors and then yes. Lord's yes. mercy will come. Only you can say no, only need mercy. Both need, two fingers. 
One is called your and reverse sister and another lost mercy. This way. So for this regard, Mahaprabhu asks this. Hey, what is the highest knowledge with the and the essence of knowledge? Vidya Mundi. Vidya Mundi kun Vidya Sar. Krishna Bhakti Vidya Vina Nahi Aar. Krishna Bhakti. What is the essence of our life? How to practice devotion and service to God? Eating, sleeping, defending and meeting. This is the common human life and animal's life. Hey, but human life means how to practice Devotional service to Lord. Krishna Bhakti. But how to practice Krishna Bhakti? And first Adu Guru Padasra. First taking shelter, lotus feet of Guru. Then Diksha, Siksha, Vishram, Venu, Guru Seva. And there are 64 limbs of Bhakti. Guru Padasra. Taking shelter, lotus feet of Guru. Then Receiving Diksha Mantra. Vishram eh? Bheno Guru Seva. Intimacy serve the Lotus Feet of Guru. Guru Seva. Guru Susva Bhakta Sarva Lavena Chal. Sangeno Sadhuna Ishwara Aradhana Chal. Prahlad Maharaj he told this verse. Eh? Prahlad Siksha. Understand? The teaching of Prahlad Maharaj. Very important. Eh? Understand? This is our basic what is called? Knowledge, foundation. foundation of spiritual life. For Lad Charitra and Dhruva Maharaj. This is very important. How was the Guru Nista? Eh? Nowadays, Guru Nista slowly, slowly mm. going down. Eh? Everybody going to jump to eh? Rasalila Katha, di, di, di. And want to listen Rashlila Katha. And they don't want to listen Pralat Siksha. They don't want to listen Dhruva Maharaj Charitra Katha. But Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asks to Gadadhar, Gadadhar, again and again you glorify about the character of Dhruva Maharaj. Dhruva Maharaj. And Prahlad Katha. And Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Prabhupada, he told, if you really enter in Suddha Bhakti, at least how many times? Hundred times, Satadhik. How many times? Hundred times. times. You have to read Dhruva Dhruva Maharaj, the character of Dhruva Maharaj, and Prahlad Charitra, the teaching of Prahlad Maharaj. And nowadays, People, they don't, they don't want to listen. Eh? They don't want to listen. Pralhat Katha or Dhruva Maharaj. They want, everybody want to listen. Which Katha? Rasa Lila Katha. Eh? But no. Eh? First, again and again, again and again, you have to listen Prahlad Charitra, Dhruva Maharaj This is very important. Then, first this is called Guru Sususa Bhakta Sarva Lavina Chara Sangeno Sadhana Isra Aradhana Chara Guru Sususa. Rendering, rendering service to the spirit of Guru. Then, ultimately Krishna Bhakti will manifest in the heart. Guru Sususa, Guru Susa Bhakti. Sangeno Sadhana Isra Aradhana Chara Sadhu Sangha Hari Katha Nam Sankirtan. Eh? This is very important in our spiritual life. For this regard, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asks this question to Raya Ramanda. Vidya Mundi Kona Vidya. Vidya Mundi Kona Prabhu Kona Vidya Kona Vidya Kona Vidya Kona Vidya Kona Vidya Kona Vidya Kona Krishna Bhakti Vidya Nahi Aar. Krishna Bhakti Vidya. How to practice a devotion, service to Lord. This is the process. Eh? 
अन्नाभिलाषिता शून्य ज्ञान कर्मादन वृतम अनुकूल कृष्णाशील भक्ति उत्तम उत्तम भक्ति हाइस्ट डिवोशन सर्विस टू लॉर्ड बेसिक फाउंडेशन हाउस ऑफ द गुरु निष्ठा श्रद्धा पांडे आई टोल वी हैव नीड दैट कॉल अत्यंत की श्रद्धा और श्रद्धा अत्यंत की श्रद्धा श्रद्धा विल का We have not listened Hari Katha, how possible? Bhakti will come. So for the Vishnu Chakravarti Pad again explain. Adu Guru Mukhat Hari Katha Sravanam. Eh? First to understand what the conception. Eh? Guru Bija Hari Katha. The conceptions of the spiritual master. What the conception of the eh? spiritual master? Eh? He Brahma Vadi, Maya Vadi, or Krishna Bhakti. You have to listen. You understand? If you are not listen Hari Katha from your Guru, then how possible should that will manifest in your heart? This is very important. You understand? Mm-hmm. Eh? So, Adu Guru Makhat Hari Katha Sravanam. This is not chapter worthy. Bad explain this way. Eh? If you not listen. Hari Katha from your Guru. So how will you know? Jo what is your Guru's heart, conception, vichar? What is that things? Eh? Guru Maya Badi or eh? Brahma Badi? Eh? Which Badi? How do you know? Eh? Sunya Badi. Sunya Badi. Many Badi. <laughs> Daita Badi or Daita Badi? Eh? Daita Daita. Eh? दैत दैतवादी सुक्रवर्ती पाद एक्सप्लेन आदु गुरु मुखात हरि कथा श्रवण देन हिज विचार कंसेप्शन यू अंडरस्टैंड ने लिस्ट हरि कथा सो हाउ सुद्धा भक्ति विल मैनिफेस्ट इन ब्रह्मांड भ्रमित को भगवान जीव गुरु कृष्ण प्रसाद पाए भक्ति लता बीज माली हैया से बीज करे आरोपन श्रवण कीर्तन जले कर In the heart of his disciple, how through Hari Katha? Eh? Try to understand this. Rajamanda Sangbad just we also listen this Katha. Eh? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Eh? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is the ocean of. Eh? Tattva Siddhanta. Yari saying. संचार्य राम अविध भक्त मेघे सभक्ति सिद्धांत चमृता गौराब्धि अमुना विस्तीर्ण तजगत रत्नालय तम प्रजाति चैतन्य महाप्रभु ऑल तत्व सिद्धांत एज ओशन ऑफ तत्व सिद्धांत एंड दैट तत्व सिद्धांत एगेन मैनिफेस्टेड इन द हार्ट ऑफ राय रमानंद Again, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu also listen from Raya Ramananda. Eh? Give an example as like ocean water, na? No? The rays of the sun, eh? Taking the water from the ocean, eh? That the that the water coming vapor and going in where sky and making cloud, eh? Just a, they had giving example and eh? cloud. 
and again same water falling in where ocean but one thing is you are very you cannot drink one drop of the water of the ocean ocean but same water vapor and going to cloud eh and coming that then can drink or not eh what is the salt evaporate some miracle then eh miracle or not you you cannot drink one drop of water from the ocean very salty eh you drink or not yaar is very close eh 100 meters 100 meters there go and the ocean check one asman yeah but same water eh rays of sun vapor going to the sky sky eh then cloud or sometimes also what is called mist no no dropping the hail hail stone hail stone hail stone na sometimes we eating or not no it is are yes it's small more than small more than children also eating eh for us very small small boy na understand and taking now here is you playing eh okay and that that you can eat also the eh what is called hail stone hail stone Huh? you are english no yes. i am not english man so we understand huh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> understand or not yes. understand health story as if that time health story you can eat or not mm-hmm. just put your mouth i see i see that is not salty mm. so how the salt is gone some miracle huh so same actual this example has given in this way Eh, very nice, beautiful this katha. Eh, yar, explain this way. Eh, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is boundless nectarian ocean of the established conclusions of devotion. That is called bhakti siddhanta, and he is a devotee. Raghavanda is the cloud whom he feeds. filled with this conclusion about the devotion to him when mahaprabhu express experience the rain of bhakti tatva that rayamanda cloud showed up on him and he was transformed into an ocean of jewels Very clearly explain this way eh just given exam this with you the water is going or is going sky like in the cloud a rain coming actually this rain is falling different different place also and especially here in the ocean many oysters oyster they open their mouth and when that the one special what is called satyak nakatra constellation and and that also coming and enter in the mouth of the oyster and then manifest powers bolo in na van vihari lal ki and and same water shakti nikhat water and falling at different different places and also mention different different things also and if the dropping on the head of elephant that is called gajamukta gajamukta understand and and same and sati water of sati nagatra for it on the on the hood a or the on the hoods of snake that is called jewels of snake that is sat pamani sat pamani eh different different hmm. same sati water of sati nagatra and falling different different way hmm. and different when name and different things will come eh here actually here Krishnadas Kaviraj Goswami in the first log of Rayamanda Sangbad, eh, he very nicely explained this tattva. Let Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, eh, he is Krishna, eh, 
and he's the full of and that go raso baisa he the completely and the ocean of melus raso 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 baisa jeva rabda nandir bhagwati akhil rasamrita sindhu paschimot ruchiruddha tarakapali kolito sama lolito radha prana vidhur jayate rupa gosai pad he composed this verse bhakti rasamrita sindhu eh this lok dekha invocation lok eh the krishna bhagavan he has an unlimited and ras rasa samudra and that means is that krishna he is called vishay tattva and object of divine love ar shrimati radhika she is called shelter of divine love rasa is this Yesterday I told you how the rose creates melodies when astra and vishal are meeting together, and that time rose manifests. Well, because only one vishal tattva object of that divine love that is called Krishna. Well, except Krishna, everybody that is called astra tattva, shelter of love. Well. If you know Krishna Katha, and if it's a very nice, beautiful, eloquent word speaking, that is not Krishna Katha, mundane Katha. Bhakti will not manifest. Eh? But everything should be related with Krishna Katha. Eh? Krishna Katha Puri, and beside Katha Puri Hari, Mukhe Bolo Hari Hari. Give up the mundane talk and always speak. कृष्ण कथा है एक कृष्ण विषय तत्व ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ द डिवाइन एंड दिस इज इंपॉर्टेंट आई एम सेइंग दिस थिंग्स बिकॉज़ रस स्मेल वाज मैनिफेस्टेड इन द हार्ट ऑफ द डिवोटी दिस वाज एंड 49 टाइप्स ऑफ इंग्रेडिएंट्स व्हेन एंड व्हाट इज कॉल्ड मीटिंग टुगेदर है On the platform of Thai Bhaus, and Chari Samagri Milone Hoyto Rasal. Chetan Chetan Mantan. When the four ingredients manifest in the platform of fixed mood, Thai Bhaus, the Rasal is coming. Vibhav, Unubhav, Sakti, Vibhichar. Huh? This coming in this. And then. आश्रय आलम्बन आई आलम्बन देन उद्दीपन आश्रय आलम्बन देन विषय आलम्बन देन थर्टी थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ संचारी भाव ऑल द इनग्रीडियंट्स मीटिंग टुगेदर दे रस इज कम सो नाउ कैलकुलेट हाउ मेनी इनग्रीडियंट्स नीड फोर्टी नाइन फोर नाइन फर्स्ट वन इज कॉल फिक्स मोर स्थायी भाव एंड देन अश्राप्तिक विकार एट स्टैसिक सिम्टम्स हाउ मेनी नाइन और सेवेन गौन रस है हाउ मेनी गौन मीन सेकेंडरी रस हास्य अद्भुत वीर विवत्स कर लाफ दे दी हाउ मेनी सिक्सटीन है देन प्लस थर्टी थ्री संचारी भावनी दिस इज द कैलकुलेशन दिस देन रॉसो विल कम दिस सो लॉर्ड चैतन्य महापुरुष भगवान ही कृष्ण एंड इज गिविंग ऑल दिस थिंग टू राय रमानंद एंड अगेन Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he listened from Raya Rama. As like Lord Narayan, he manifests all Tattva Siddhanta in the heart of Brahma. Then Brahma Ji realized everything. That is called Chatu Sloki Bhagavat, four slokas. How many slokas? Four. Very nice video. Now time is over.
And I will speak this thing. And he said, no, Mahaprabhu is is giving everything to Raya Ramana. And Bhakta and Bhagavan. Or Bhagavan and Bhakta. Three things are important in our spiritual life. What is called? Bhakta, Bhakti and Bhagavan. And middle is what? Bhakti. Bhakti Revanayati, Bhakti Revadarsati, Bhakti Vasa Purusha. And Bhakti brings towards Lord. Understand? Why I am saying? Because you are saying Krishna Bhakti Vina Nahi Dikhipa. Vidya, what is your Krishna Bhakti Vidya? So, here <coughs> Ravananda very clearly explained the Krishna Bhakti Vina Vidya Nahi are. And Krishna Bhakti Vidya, that is called how to serve to Krishna. And how to serve to Krishna? And topmost service that is called we can serve to Krishna with four ways. Dasava, Sakkava, and Vatsala and Madhurja. Dasava, who serves to Dasava? Unumanji, eh? Dasavab Siva. Eh? And that Dasavab also need is one thing. Mamata Yukta Siva. Sabichal mood coming two ways. Listen very carefully. One is called Samandagyan, knowledge of relationship, and another positiveness. That is called Mamata. Eh? You understand? Mm -hmm. Mamata is very important. This is mine. Eh? This is mine. Mamata. Eh? Minus. Minus. Eh? Minus. 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 Mamata is coming this. Eh? Nanda Maharaj is thinking, I am the father of my son Krishna. Or Krishna is my son. My son. Eh? You are saying? Mm -hmm. What is he saying? Mm -hmm. My son. Yes. My daughter. And my house, Mamata. My cow. And my cow. <laughs> this is it. Mamata. But this is it. This. That's about this. Samantha. But one thing, Hunuman is hard. Some opulence moon. Krishna. Ramchandra is Bhagavan. And Rakta Patra in Vrindavan. They serve to Krishna. But they never think Krishna is Bhagavan. Any Brajavasis, they never think Krishna is Bhagavan. Krishna, he belongs to our family member. That's that Sanskrit word. That is called Lokik Sadhvandhu Vat Yati. Understand? And they say, Seva. That's what. Shakha Bhav Seva. Subal Shridam. The perfect example. Subal Shridam. They serve to Krishna with their Friendship mood. Kandi chori, kandi chora. Sometimes they climb on the shoulder of Krishna and sometimes they also carry on. Carry Krishna. Carry to Krishna. Sometimes they, get, they, they also give their own remnants to Krishna. Or sometimes they are taking remnants from Krishna. So much intimacy, love and affection. Their Vatsala Seva. And parental mood, Nanda Jasuda, Matamuri Putra Bhavi Kare, Lalana Palana. Krishna says, My mother Jasuda, nourishment me as like her innocent baby. Krishna think I am completely innocent. Huh? Mm -hmm. Krishna innocent or not? Brijavasi. Krishna Patam this Lila. And another service. Chapman service, that is called Madhur Joshiva. Sweetness mode. Madhur Joshiva. That Madhur Joshiva again divided into there is one Sakyatta Bhav energy is called Parikyatta Bhav. Eh? Relation with wife and husband or relation with lover and beloved. 
But lover and beloved, this parakyatva, only braj, inside your braj, not all. Braj bina nahi, anatra prachar. You understand? Chaitanya Chaitanya. Braj bina nahi, anatra, this parakyatva, parakul mood, only inside braj. Not in Vaikuntha, Ajuddha, Dharaka, Mathura. Only Golub Vrindavan. And only in the heart of the gopis. Not others. Eh? This is that. So now come in this way. Why am I saying this is the how to know this these types of knowledge, Vidya. Sad this. Eh? Everything is coming from mercy of Guru and Krishna. Not only reading the books, just I told the Panditji. He is explained about. <laughs> Background tiger. Big grow. This is Rupina Grayati. Grayati. Granayati. Taking the smell. But when tiger come and killed him. Eat him. So saying this. Knowledge is not enough. Need is what? Gan and began. And jnana, vijjana, jat, aitika. Gyan means knowledge. A vijjana means realization. A realization. Actually, this vijjana coming from where? Srimati Radhika. Eh? You understand? Without this mercy of Srimati Radhika, any method, eh? a realization will not come. Eh? So for this regard, need is what? Want the sprinkle mercy of <coughs> Srimati Radhika, Radha Kripa Kataksh. And every day, Munindra Vinda Vandite, Tilaka Soka Harini, Prasanna Bhatra Pankaji, Nikunja Bhubi Lasini, Brajandra Bhanu Nandini, Brajandra Sunu Sangate, Kadakari Sasyaman Kripa Kataksh Vajana. Radha Kripa Kripa. I will receive on the sprinkle, sidelong glance of Srimati Radhika. Radha Kripa Kripa. But one thing Srimati Radhika will directly not give mercy to us. Mm. Eh? Mm. What will do? Mm -hmm. We have to take shelter. <coughs> eh? Who is very, take shelter with his feet of Guru Patma, who is very near and dearest of Srimati Radhika. That is called. And what is it called? Radha Priyasakhi. Radha Priyasakhi. Radha Guru Rupa Shakhi. And you have to meditate this. And step by step I also explain this. This is important also. And if you want to meditate Guru Rupa Shakhi, then you read Jyoti Arjika. Giti Gucha, you can see. And it's written in there. Understand? First or second page or third page. And Giti Gucha, the book. Guru Rupa Sakit Dhyan. First to understand your own Dhyan, that is called Atma Dhyan. You know Atma Dhyan? The meditation of your soul. Atma Dhyan. This is very important. Atma Dhyan, Guru Dhyan, meditation. You bhajan and sadhan. This is the process. But everything depends on how much your Guru Nishtha. And again return back, Prahlad Mani, Prahlad Siksha, the teaching of Prahlad Maharaj. Guru Susu Sahabhakta Sarva Lavi Nacho. Sangeno Sadhuna Isaradha Aradhana Nacho. Guru Shishra. Rishnara means service of Guru, Guru Pat, Guru Shiva. Two kinds of Guru Shiva. One is called Bopu Shiva. Another is called Bani Shiva. Bopu Shiva, that is called physical. Sat to Guru, cooking for him. Massage his face. This is called Bopu Shiva. Washing his clothes. And 
What is he saying? Ironing? Ironing. Ironing. Ironing is club. Ironing. Huh? Not ironing. Ironing. Huh? This is true or wrong? Huh? True. But this is all the external. Huh? Bani Seva is very important. I am not saying uh, reject your Bajju. I am not saying reject. There is no need to go. Next time. Next You also need. Uh, but important give emphasis to thing. Bani Seva. Uh, Guru is one. Many disciples. Everything go Guru. I will cook for you. I will also. Uh, Passing a cloth, did this thing. I one cloth good day. So good. Then also, disciples, what they do? Fighting to each other. Understand? Or crying, oh, good day, good day, he does not like to me. He did not to give me seva. People are saying, you're not saying. Every day, this complaint comes. <laughs> uh, oh, Guru Dev, he, he uh, don't like me. Uh, understand? Because Guru Dev, he did not give seva. any seva. What seva? Guru Dev, don't, don't, like, don't like me to, uh, to massage his feet. He does not like to... Uh, I am my... Huh? Iron, iron, iron my clothes. <laughs> what did you say? Iron, iron. iron clothes. <laughs> iron. Are there many kinds of Guru Seva? Eh? Best service of Guru Seva is called here. You ah. preach. Eh? Spread the message of Guru and Krishna. Eh? Go to the what is called? Park. Go to the uh, market. Go to the... Seafront. Hey, <laughs> Last you said, Hare Krishna! Hare Krishna! Hare Krishna! 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 Hare Hare! Hare Rama! Hare Rama! Rama Rama! Hare Hare! Eh, Bhakti Siddhanta Sarasri Prabhupada, he told, eh, he told his Brahmachari, just take the, what do you call, saffron cloth and walk in the street. Yeah, this is also Guru Seva. Mm -hmm. Well, how possible? People will say, oh, this is the cloth. Eh? What is cloth? Suffering cloth. Will, oh, this is coming from mm -hmm. Gauri Mata yeah. Sadhu. Mm -hmm. eh? Understand? Then automatically people, they also, curiosity coming. Mm -hmm. eh? This is also important. Simple. Mm -hmm. eh? Don't sit in one place. Eh? And say, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Namayanshi. Namayanshi. I'm chanting holy name. Nobody there? Then, sleeping. And if anybody coming, then, Hare Krishna, Ram, 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 Hare Krishna. Understand? No. And Bhakti and the Prabhupada, that time he told my Brahmachari, they have to go out and walk. In the street. street, market, and go there everywhere. Mm -hmm. And tell to read, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, 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 Hare Hare. Gents and ladies, everybody. You went today? You went today? Huh? We have to inspire to the people. Huh? They did Hare now today. Huh? As he's saying, only two persons. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, everybody has to. Eh? Who now? Eh? He's saying, where is the invitation? But I said, um, I, said I put it on WhatsApp and tried to tell everyone. No, no, people, they, are, they have no WhatsApp, they are not no, Google. You have to give them, make the flyer, flyer, print it, and give to you. At least just to write in the Mahamantra. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Then at least they also do only this. Mm -hmm. Mantra, Hare Krishna. This is also that Sukriti will come. One day they will become devotee. One day they will come also. Mm -hmm. huh? Give the books. And, and you print small, small books. Yeah. Huh? Just mm -hmm. and 10 pages or something this. Yes. Huh? Small, small books. Mm -hmm. huh? Look, this is all. Huh? We take this. Mm -hmm. huh? They will read. Huh? One day they will read. 
But one day they will put, uh, they will put in their shelf. And one day they will read, what is this? Mm-hmm. And here all Krishna Nama is not there. Mm-hmm. Eh? Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, 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 Krishna Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. I am saying this to you. This is called the best Guru Seva. Understand? Eh? One of his guru, he wants this thing actually. Eh? And who is not bona fide guru? Okay, say, you are my disciple. Eh? Bring many kinds of eh? delicious food and feed to me. Eh? No, bona fide guru always say, eh? Please, very now. Mahaprabhu told, Jari Dekar Tarika Krishna Padesh. Amar Aggai Guru Hiya Tarai Desh. If you say anybody, chant my brother and sister, chant holy names. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. If our householder, if our renounced order, this is not sad. Everybody, please, this is Guru Shri. I said this. Without Guru Seva, how possible Bhakti Devi will manifest in our heart? Eh? And best service of Guru Seva, that is called <coughs> Bani Seva. That is called Brihat Mridam Seva. Eh? Brihat Mridam. That is called printing the books. Eh? All you are scholar. All you have knowledge also. Something just right. What do you listen from Guru? Eh? Just to write, print out. Understand? No problem. Just to write. And three, four pages. And and, and making very nice, beautiful booklet. And, and you to take this. And understand? And also they will give some donation. Sometimes giving them, they don't give them no problem. This is not your object and to collect the money. Uh, if they give, that is way good, yeah. then you uh, mm-hmm. serve, again reprint. Mm-hmm. Or even not giving, no problem. Mm-hmm. Krishna will give. Mm-hmm. So I always inspire to everyone. Everybody, print out these books. Mm-hmm. And not so many pages, small, small pages. Mm-hmm. If you big book, people will not also take it. Mm-hmm. Carry all this. Mm-hmm. And uh, mm-hmm. small book, you can put on the pocket. Mm-hmm. Uh, big books, very difficult or not? Mm-hmm. Airport, they will be charged and this for the other guy. Extra? Extra? Are this a small one? Eh? Keep your hand. Mm-hmm. Eh? Okay. Understand? Okay. Yeah. And give the even airport. <laughs> and even a flight, who is also eh? <laughs> in front of you can take this. <laughs> they will be very at least. Our big Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad my God. <laughs> thank you. They will say thank you. But this will be very easy. So this will be. Except or not. Mm-hmm. Guru Sushu. For them saying this, a Guru Sushu Bhakta Sarva Radhanisha. Sangeno Sadhana Isra Aradhanisha. Guru Sushu is very important. Then Bhakti Devi will manifest in our heart. Eh? So here Rairman Dajan, Rairman is saying this, eh? now time is one, now we pray. Eh? Kirti Madhya Jivir Kun Bada Kirti, Krishna Bhakta Buriya Jhar Hoi Khati. Eh? Many name, fame, reputation in this material world. Eh? But topmost name, fame, that is called Krishna Bhakta. How will become the devotee of Krishna? Eh? Even in your dynasty, one Vaishnav Bhakta will come. And then and all your dynasty, they will be dead back on the ocean of air. This also. How is powerful Krishna Bhakta? And Sarge Nittanti, in the heaven. And all the demigods have, and what is called? Flowering. Showering. 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 Flowers. Flowers. Sowering flowers. flowers. Pusso beast. Eh? Mm. And all your forefathers, they start to dance. Mm. Eh? The Shastra is saying this. 
Sometimes we give an example in the Quran Katha Nidra. One person, he committed many sinful activities, Papa Karma. You understand? Then he was in the hell, Narak. You understand? And that the, uh, what is called? Jamadutas. Uh, Jamadutas means? The attendance of Jam Maharaj. Uh, also cut, cut him and down him in the uh, oil. Boiling oil or something. Yeah, they just take an end doing down in the Narakunda and Safari. Yeah. Yeah. But that person, yeah, when Jamadutta was put down in the water and again coming up, that time that person was laughing. Ha ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> Jamadutta was again yeah. Yeah, downing in the water. Again coming up, that time he was laughing. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Then Damodhita was asked the person, Hey, why are you are laughing? Here everybody is suffering, crying. But you are not crying, you are laughing. Ha ha ha. We are downing in the Narak. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Help. Help. But you are laughing, why? And that time that person told, Listen very carefully. Today you are Downing in this narak. Mm. Eh? Understand? But tomorrow, all you worship my lotus feet. <laughs> well, how? Why? Because I am looking eh? in one great devotee, Bhakta. Eh? He is coming in my dynasty. dynasty. Eh? Then I will deliver. Then all you. Eh? To pranam to me. Maravinna one we are. You understand? Once with the Bhakta will come your root dynasty. Eh? Then seven generals, even the what is called? Konishto Dikari. Devotee. Eh? Nephi devotee. Then is seven generation, mother side and father side, they will also deliver on this material. Or Madam Adhikari, intermediate devotee. Then his 14th generation also delivered on this. Or Uttam Bhagavat will come. Then his 21 generation devotee. Vaishnava Jesang Kulina Vaishnava Nama Dhyam. If the one devotee will come in our dynasty, then our life will be successful. Eh? Understand? Yeah. Shuddha Bhakti. Yeah. Eh? Vaishnava is not ordinary things. Eh? But, but carefully these things. And eh? even you don't know your own glorification. All you are Vaishnava. <laughs> Who is not Vaishnava? Raise your hand. All you are Vaishnava. <laughs> eh? Why? <laughs> Why you are in question? No, not laughing, joking. Seriously, you understand. Those who receive Diksha Mantra from Guru, they are called Vaishnav. Girito Vishnu Dikkako, Vishnu Puja Paro Naraha, Tasmat Vaishnava. And one who received Diksha, received and Vishnu Mantra from Guru, he is called Vaishnava. Simple way. And you cannot say, I am not Vaishnava. You are Vaishnava. Eh? Grito, this, grito, grito, Vishnu Mantra. This, eh? So you are Vaishnava. Simple. Eh? But what kinds of Vaishnava? There is another category is coming. Eh? You are all your Vaishnava. I cannot say you are not Vaishnava. Eh? All, already you offer the Lord's feet of Guru. Then give an example. Vishnathir, give an example. One flower here. And unknowingly you can step. Maybe you can step your feet. That's the flower. But that flower and the another flowers which offer to Lord, Lord's feet of Lord Vishnu. You cannot touch the feet. That's the flower. What do you say? Follow. Uh, uh, no, if you offer a flower to the lotus 
uh, feet of the Lord, you cannot offer that same flower to your own feet. If you stand on the flower, on an ordinary flower, but yes, if you stand on an ordinary flower, you can you can stand cannot be, but you can also. Your feet maybe touch the ordinary flower. flowers. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's not offense. Mm -hmm. But one flower who is offered to Lord. lotus feet of Lord Vishnu, mm -hmm. you, you, you can cannot touch, touch your feet, that, that offense. Mm -hmm. so that means is what? One who received Diksha Mantra from Guru, that means he already mm -hmm. offered with Krishna, Vishnu. Mm -hmm. Eh? Guru Mantra, Krishna Mantra is there. Eh? Namo, Swaha. Eh? Swani. Gopijan, Vallabhaya, Swaha. Swaha. Swamani? So. Ha means? Offer. That means you offer to yourself to love. So you are Vaishnava. Eh? So saying this word, Grito Vishnu Dikhaako Vishnu Puja Paru Naraha. And one who received Diksha, Vishnu Diksha Mantra from Guru, he is called Vaishnava. Vaishnava is definition. So all you Vaishnava. And those who not receive Diksha Mantra from Guru, he is called Avaishnava. He is Vaishnava and he is called Avaishnava. And very simple. One who worships the Surya, Sun God, he is called Saura. One who worships and Vishnu, he is called Vaishnava. One who worships Sun eh, Shiva, he is called Saiva. One who worships Devi Durga Kali Shakti, that is called Sakta. Eh, Saura Sakta. Ganapatta, one who worships Ganesh, he is called Ganapatta. Or one who worships Vishnu, he is called Vaishnava. Or eh? one, one who worships Simati Radhika, he is called? Eh? One who worships Krishna, he is called Karshna. Or one who worships Simati Radhika, he is called? Gauriya. Balavinda, one of the You understand? If you receive Gaur Mantra, Gaur Gayatri, you are Gauriya. So which best? Gauriya. You are called. You are called. You are belongs to Srimati Radhika. Radha, Radha Rani Ki Jai. You are belongs to whom? Srimati Radhika. Understand? This is very important. So very carefully every day chant and Guru Mantra, Gayatri Mantra, Gaur Mantra. Gaur Gayatri Mantra, Krishna Mantra, Gopal Mantra, all mantras. Hey, many devotees ask, I ask them, hey, are you chanting or not? But I am not chanting. This is offense of our heart. But you chant. Hey, Guru says chant, disciple call, chant. Are you chant, chant, chant? Disciple says, chant, chant, chant. Hey, chant. No, chant. Hey? Chant holy names. Eh? Never upavas, nam upavas. Upavas understand? Never fast in chanting holy names. Every day chant holy names. Understand? You think holy names means Krishna himself. Eh? This is not the Nimmala or this is not the Tulsimala. This is Krishna himself. Eh? First to understand this, some, this is the simple faith, Saral Viswas. The Gurudev, he gave me Krishna. Japa Mala, this means this is a combined from Radha and Krishna. Try to understand this, faith. Otherwise you should know faith, what you do? Mm. Eh? Going running here and there. Mm. Eh? Mm. Gurudev told, some cows, mm. originally, eh? eating grass from here, some grass eating here, some grass eating here. Jantara khatarata. No. Huh? Very carefully understand this. You bhajan and sadhan. 
एंड निष्ठा गुरु निष्ठा नाम निष्ठा भजन निष्ठा 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 अभी मीन निष्ठा नाम निष्ठा एवरी डे चांड होली नेम यू लेस नो प्रॉब्लम माय गुरुदेव सेइंग दिस वे यू चांड लेस नंबर्स नो प्रॉब्लम बट एवरी डे हैव टू चांड अंडरस्टैंड बिकॉज दिस जप माला गुरुदेव गिविंग मींस इज द पोटेंशियल देयर समबडी से आई एम चांडिंग माय फिंगर्स कॉरी जप इज कॉर जप नो है और मेटल काउंट दिस इज नॉट परफेक्ट है सम टाइम यू आर दी चांटिंग व्हाट इज कॉल्ड क्लिक है हरि कृष्ण हरि कृष्ण हरि कृष्ण है दैट इज मैकेनिकल है देन यू विल वन डे यू विल बी आल्सो नो गुरुदेव गुरुदेव इस बार नान कृष्ण में नेवर अलाउ इफ एंड यू डू गुरुदेव बिकम वेरी एंग्री और दिस मॉड दे आर दे सेइंग Will they become very angry? Mm. They have to every day chant mm. Hari Nam with mm. Japa Mala. Guru they give one the shakti is there, potency is there. Mm. You understand? Mm. Huh? Mm. Uh, that 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 the Guru they gave you. That they okay. What is called? Yeah. <laughs> we call Guru they give it in our Guru Parampara. Anybody see? <laughs> What is coming this day? Huh? <laughs> not allowed. Any method, not allowed. Mm. Understand? Gurudev, this is Gurudev lecture. You can listen in the, what is called. And Gurudev morning walk. One devotee, <laughs> Gurudev become very angry. But the the Gurudev told no. Eh? Tole si mala japa. Eh? This is. Eh? Now every day have we chant holy names with chapta mala, which we receive from Guru. That shakti is there, and eh? it's very important. Every day chant holy names and eh? with holy chapta mala. Guru they give me the shakti inside is there. You cannot see, and eh? you cannot see the potency. How the potency in in there? But we chant. शक्ति उल्का हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 Don't you think this is Tulsi Mala or this is Nim Mala? Ah, this is Guru Dev Gopi. This is direct Radha and Krishna. For faith, at least Aru Siddha Bhakti. You know, Aru Siddha Bhakti means imposing. First Bhakti, Bhakti three stages. What one is called Aru Siddha Bhakti, another is called Sangha Siddha Bhakti, a third stage that is called Sarup Siddha Bhakti. Aru means impose. Gurudev told, "This Japamala is not different from Krishna. One hundred eight bits, and eh? and middle, Krishna, Krishna, Radha and Krishna there. Yeah. Eh? Understand? And then also eight shakti jar there. Yeah? Then mm-hmm. one small thread is there. Eight shakti jar. Everything explained this way. Eh? Eh? Also in the one one hundred eight." Also, you are there also. Yeah. <laughs> When you do bhajan and sadhan, they will realize yourself. Huh? One hundred eight gopis are there. If your mother says you are also there, you don't know now. Everything is there. You understand? Huh? Which one would it be? You are not ordinary person. You are also. गोपी इंडिया रिवर्टी फर्स्ट जस्ट दे डू भजन इन साइड रिलाइजेशन विल कम है एंड विथ फेथ है गुरु एंड कृष्ण सरल विश्वास हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम
first time she explained this way, and in South India, and there was one Brahman, and and his boy, he has one boy, maybe five years old, and still he has no Brahman thread, you know. So one day, Brahman, he went out somewhere. Eh? Mm -hmm. So he what is he Thakurji and offering him plate Thakurji to to mm -hmm. and then Brahmani, the wife of Brahman, he told she told his <coughs> five years old son, eh? take this plate mm -hmm. and offer to Thakurji. And that boy that boy he told Mom, I don't know how to offer Thakurji. Then his mother told, listen my son, eh, just to plate this, this plate, mm -hmm. eh, offering plate, in front of Thakurji, and simply told, tell him, Thakurji, please, mm -hmm. and eh, accept this offering. offering. It's just simple. Because he does not know the mantra, Gayatri mantra, mm -hmm. eh, Gopal mantra, nothing. Even he has no thread. So according to the instruction, of his mother, the small boy. Simple faith is good. Mm -hmm. eh? Then he offered it Thakurji. Mm -hmm. eh? What was his father doing? In the same way, he offered mm -hmm. in front of Thakurji that plate and told him, Thakurji, eh, please come and eh? take this prasad. Eh? But Thakurji not coming. Coming down. Mm -hmm. eh? in. Then he start to cry. He Thakurji, please come. And why not come? Then that boy, small boy, he hold the hand of the Thakuri. Oh. Oh. And take prasad. Because every day you accept my father's offering. Why not take your... And then Thakuri came. And Thakuri ate everything. <laughs> now plate completely what? Empty. 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 And after a few minutes, maybe five, ten minutes, and that boy, and... He brought the empty plate, empty plate, and offered to his mother. Then mother asked, "Hey, my boy, what is the prasad?" Told him, "Thakurji yet?" Okay. Then mother did this. In this uh, three days, that boy offered Thakurji and Thakurji yet. Then after three days, when his father Brahmana, he returned back. And his house. Then his wife Brahmani told these things. Then my son offered to Thakurji and Thakurji ate everything. everything. And then Brahman told how possible. <laughs> I am Brahmana. I have second thread. Every day I am chanting Gayatri Mantra. Om Bhurbhu was Gayatri Mantra. And offering this mantra, Gopal Mantra, even mantra I offered to Thakurji. But I did not see Thakurji ate everything. Mm -hmm. And my son, only five years old. <laughs> he has no sacred thread, no Gopal Mantra, no Gayatri Mantra. Mm -hmm. Even he doesn't know the Suddha Sadacha, <coughs> good behavior. How to offer him. Understand? How to give Achman. You know Achman. Idam Achman Kesavayana, Idam Achman Madhavayana, Idam Achman Narayana. And Idam Asanam Tukbhang. Nothing. I just he offered, he just he put the plate in front of the Thakurji, Thakurji ate. It is impossible. I don't believe. <laughs> <coughs> then Brahmani, and the wife of Brahmani, no, no, my son, he did not tell lie. And he said, then Brahmani said, okay, tomorrow I will pretend. Mm -hmm. and just him hiding back of the Thakurji. Then you tell my son, he offered, I will see, daddy, I will see how Thakurji is eating, eating or not. Eh? And so then Brahmani cooked eh, and everything and told his son, Oh, my son, your father has gone somewhere. So you offer this plate to Thakurji. Same way. Then his son, very simple boy, no? Five years old, simple. He offered plate in front of Thakurji. Many kinds of delicious, delicious preparation. Eh? Laddu, kachori, mon, rasgulla, eh? basmati, dudish, eh? dudish, eh? 
you know, Dudish Kadam is there. Dudish Rash. And Govinda Bhog, Basmati Rash, and Mahi. And Kapari. But today, that boy is simple. He told her, Thakurji, please come and take prasad. But Thakurji is not coming. Then he holds the hand of Thakurji. Hey, Thakurji, why you are you angry with me? Why are not coming? Come. Now Thakurji is very heavy. Mm-hmm. That boy can't do? Mm-hmm. Move. Hey, Thakurji, please come. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, if you not eat, then my mother will be telling with me. Yeah. Eh? Three days you ate everything. Today, why not coming? Why not eating? Why you are you angry with me? What is my fault? Thakurji, please come. Please come. Please come. Eh? Then Thakurji told, actually you have no fault. Your father, <laughs> <laughs> your father has no faith. Yeah, I am? Take it. Eating, take it. Uh-huh. Eh? No, no, please eat. Eh? Then Thakurji also just one or two. Handsome? Mm-hmm. Then his father told, hey, Thakurji, if we ate everything, then what will eat? <laughs> then Thakurji become very angry to be no one. <laughs> hey Brahman, you offer to me, I, I will never accept your offering because you have no faith. I, but your son, small boy, hey, though he has no Brahman Diksha, but he has simple faith. I read it. Huh? So that means is why your faith will be as like baby. Sisubhat Biswas. Simple faith. Not innocent. Simple faith. Understand? The Lord will accept you. Accept all your offering. Saral Biswas. Bhakti, I am saying, Bhakti not depend on anything. Bhakti depends on only your simple faith. Again, also recited these words. Nayang atma pravachana labho no medvaya no pahuna suteno jame vise virute teno labho tasis atma vidrunute tanusham. That simple faith. Then Lord will accept all your help. Offering everything. Help. If you read many vast of knowledge, as like the Panditji, you know, background. Mm-hmm. I already I told. Mm-hmm. And so in Ayamat Mahaprajan Labbo no Medhya no Bhunash Puti no Jami Vishya Bhunati Tenu Labbo Tasyasa Vibhunati Tonu Sama. When you simple faith, Lord will manifest everything in your heart. Saral Vishya. But first faith in the lotus feet of Guru and Krishna. First Guru, Guru Patko Vishwas. Eh? For this regard, every day, what is chanting? What is singing? Sri Guru Cha Rana Padma Kibala Bhakati Sadma Bandha Mui Sabodhana Mahi Hare Sabodhane Sabodhane Bandari Bhai Guru Deve Abhay Charan Sabodhane Bandari Bhai Aparadha Hai Na Jainu Sabodhane Bandari Bhai Oh my brother, very carefully eh, to worship the Buddha's feet of Guru. Aparadha Hai Na, don't commit Often says Lord Speak of Guru. Guru Apurka, Guru Aparat. This is very important. Eh? Never committed. Often says Lord Speak of Guru. Eh? If Guru please you, then Krishna, everything please you. Tasmin Tushte? No, no. If Guru will please, then if, uh, if Guru is please, then everybody will please. And or this local. Guru Tushte. Tasmin Tushte. No. And Pataman to Gujman. If Guru Dev will please. And. Tasmin Tushte Jagat Tushte. No, no, no. If, 
If Guru plays with it, no, and Krishna. Huh? Krishna. Guru Rushte. Haru Guru Trata. Or Guru Rushte? Not a question. Haru Rushte Guru Trata. If Krishna is angry with you and plays with you, Guru can protect you. And if Guru and plays, no one can even Krishna will not protect you. Very carefully listen to this. First, our aim and object is that how to Guru Padma will be placed. Eh? This, is, this is important. Krishna will place or not, this is not our primary eh? object. Our primary object is how Gurudev will place. Eh? Is the Haru Rushti Guru Trata. Are Guru Rushti not the question? Eh? Read this one. Learn this verse. Yeah, our aim and object on the how to group up will be placed. Guru Kripa. Eh? Guru Kripa hi ke valam. How to receive the, the sprinkled mercy of Guru Padma. Eh? If Guru will please, then automatically Krishna will please us. Eh? This is important. You understand? Eh? It's very important. Our aim, again and again, I just remind you eh? how Gurudev will be placed. Eh? These things. Jai Shri Gurudev ki Jai Jai Shri Rade Paru Govinda Palo Gari I don't know.